Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alex and in today's video we are checking out Amazon's Fire HD 8 2017 uh, tablet. So this tablet is not Amazon's uh, latest Fire HD 8 uh, tablet. There's a newer version called the 2018 version. This is a 2017 version but the uh, difference isn't that huge so I went with this tablet. It's a little bit more cheaper. Um, the only difference is I think the camera at the front is a little bit better on the newer one, it's 2, two megapixels on the, on the newer one whereas um, on this one it's only 0 0.3 megapixel which is pretty pretty old tech. Um, let's talk about the specs. So on this device um, it's 32 gigabyte um, storage, um, it's got, you can get them in 16 as well. Um, the RAM is 1.5 gigabyte RAM so slightly more than the um, one I reviewed before which was the Fire 7 and that little half a gigabyte makes a difference when I'm gaming so you'll see in a bit when I start launching games you'll see how much more smoother it is. Um, the screen resolution is slightly better than the Fire 7 as well. It's 12, uh, 1280 by 800 so um, the screen quality is a little more, bit, bit, bit more better. In terms of hardware and things like that, we'll have a look at what it's got. So, at, as I mentioned, it's got 0.3 megapixels at the front, and then at the back, it's got the uh, two megapixels at the back. Um, this is another navy blue version that I've got. Um, at the sides, you've got your micro SD expansion slot. At the top, you've got your power button. You've got your charging um, slot, I think this is the mic, you've got your HD, uh, sorry, your um, headphone jack, you've got your volume rocker, and on the other side you've got two dual firing speakers, which is pretty cool, and on the bottom there's nothing there. So, what I'll do is turn that back on, and turn it this way. So, what I'll do now is have a look at the apps. So like my other um, tablet that I reviewed previously, um, I've put Google Play Store on there as well so I can download all the other games. Like I mentioned before, it comes with um, Amazon's um, App Store, which isn't that great. It doesn't have all the um, all the stuff in there, so I never use it. I just put that everything in the folder and got rid of all the um, Amazon apps because they're not really... Uh, something that I don't normally use. So I've got the Play Store on there and I've downloaded various... Uh, uh, games and things like that so I can view a demo of how that's working on this device. So what we'll do is we'll start off with uh, um, Modern Compact. So this is Mortal, um, Modern Combat. So let's have a look at how this plays. Again I don't know the controls fully so I'm just going with the flow so we'll see how it plays. So as you can see the graphics is pretty, be pretty good and um, it's not lagging as my other, as the other Fire HD did. Oh, okay. So I died. I was too slow. Let's try that again. Wait here. So as you can see, the game's pretty uh, smooth, and the resolution's pretty good as well. This is. pretty difficult playing on tablet and also videoing but this is, gives you kind of a uh, demo of how this is playing and I'm not playing I'm not looking at the screen I'm looking at my phone screen so it makes it even more difficult to see what I'm supposed to be doing but you can see the game is pretty pretty smooth and um, let's get some cover that's a quick run through of this game. What I'll do, I'll turn on another game and see how that plays. So this game is called Real Racing Free. Um, so you can see it's pretty, this is quite intensive game and as you can see it's handling the game pretty well. The graphics are really good and also it's not lagging at all. There is a few, you know, frames that are um, getting missed but apart from that it's a playable game on this tablet it has the same um, CPU as the Fire 7 
which isn't um, again not that um, not that um, powerful but you can see it's this decent game and it's, um, it's playing it without any kind of trouble and it's working fine so what I'll do is I'll start another game and we'll see how that plays so what I've done is I've launched Mortal Kombat and as you remember before if you watched my other video on the Fire 7 um, tablet it was lagging quite a bit but on this device it works quite fine and um, I'll show you how that runs after it started so as you can see the graphics I'm, I'm not sure if you can see but the um, graphics are a lot better um, than the Fire 7 because this resolution is a lot better but you can see the gameplay is it's a lot smoother than the Fire 7 so this device even with just um, it's only got 0 .0 0.5, half, half gigabyte of extra RAM and it's running a lot smoother and there's no difference to the um, CPU so, so as you can see it's all working good no problems here and the graphics is really good this game is again really intensive the graphics is really good it's not one of your um, normal uh, games it uses up quite a lot of um, uh, processing power and it's working fine so that's a quick demo of Mortal Kombat what I'll do is I'll start another app, another app and see how that runs right so what I've got on now is PUBG and if you watch my other video the Fire 7 couldn't download this game but on this uh, device is working fine so you can see that it's playing fine however I'll put it on lower settings so then it doesn't lag as much um, as you can see it's working fine <laughs> someone's got the mic on so I'm playing with random people around the world so it's um, someone's got the mic on and they're talking through it I'll put the volume down so don't so don't hear them it's pretty hard playing on um, on a device that um, where you don't have controller I think I need to invest in a controller and then come back and play it so it's not in the way so you can see the screen properly but it's a quick view on how it looks I can probably put the graphics up a little bit more better and it'll look a lot more fluid but I thought I'd play with the lowest settings for the time being just in case it wasn't able to handle it but you can see that it's, it's handling the game pretty pretty well there is a bit of stutter now and then but other than that I mean for a game that's using up so much resources processing um, resources it's not that bad I'm getting killed now I'll probably get killed because I'm not really good at games oh no he's coming he's going to kill me he's going to kill me oh, I got him I got him let's get him so there you go, this is PUBG, I uh, got my first kill on this game, um, what I'll do is I'll stop it here and then we'll open up another app. What I'll do now is I'm in the YouTube app, what I'll do is I'll give you a, a look on how the video looks like and the um, tester speakers as well because it's got dual firing speakers so it should get quite loud so I'll turn it this way around, sorry, so I'll have it this way around, play this video and we'll see how that sounds like. So. nice like aux cable so most wireless headphones they uh, if you run out of battery you can always use the um, aux cable to use your headphones still so even if it's zero it goes completely to zero you can have it wired up but these days it's a bit of a shame with all the phones not having the um, jack so yeah so let's bring back the uh, headphones and have a look at what we've got so comes in a little silky so as you can see um, it gets quite loud it's a lot louder than the Fire 7 because of the other extra speaker and also screen quality is a lot better as well with the extra um, resolution bump so it's pretty decent what I'll do is let's turn on another app so what I've got is I've got Google Chrome up and I'll give you a quick demo of how well it works um, 
most people can use these kind of tablets for you know browsing the internet really basic stuff so this is how it looks like i mean there's no kind of lags or stutter but the refresh uh refresh uh screen isn't that great but it gets the job done i mean if you just want to read some articles etc then it's it's pretty decent i mean you can the pictures coming out great videos coming out great um the text is readable i've got the um brightness up to the top so there you have it so there you have it that's my uh, quick video of me playing games and um, opening up certain apps and seeing how it performs in my honest opinion if you guys were looking to buy a uh, amazon fire tablet um, one thing to note is that you won't get the play store so that's something that you need to download yourselves it's not that difficult i mean there's tutorials online so you can um, see how to um, get that on there and you've got a proper um, Android tablet. If I had to choose between the Fire 7 and the Fire 8, I will most likely go with the 8. It's, the price wise is not much difference. I think it's about £30 difference. I think the 7 is going for £50 and this is going for um, 80 at the moment. Um, that bit of extra um, half a gigabyte of RAM does make a difference. So it's playing the games a lot better. There's not as much lags. Um, and also that extra bump in the resolution helps as well um, obviously this is the 2017 edition you can get the 2018 which has slightly better specs but not major upgrades if you guys have any questions then write them down below remember to like comment and subscribe i'll see you guys next time